Hey everybody. I was in there cleaning my bedroom up and I'm going through some old heat sinks and stuff and I happened to find this in my stash. This here was a recent pull from a dead e machine's computer. And you can kind of tell what the subject of this video is about. Let's say you didn't look at the title and you're just watching this video for the first time. Just by looking at this you can tell what the subject of this video is about. This is this comes to show the importance of keeping your computer clean on a regular basis at least every couple of months. This heat sink come off of a hot running Sauron D processor and it's a real wonder that computer didn't overheat from time to time. I'm pretty sure it was a loud machine with a fan cranking up to force air through this clogged up heat sink to keep the CPU cool. I mean it's just unreal. I mean, years ago, I, I mean, before I got into computers, I never thought about it, but, I mean, so the reasons why I make these videos is to encourage you all, computer gurus or just average Joes, pop that side panel off once in a while and take your air compressor, or at least um, compressed air in a can, and blow out your computer once in a while. I mean, this is, <laughs> this is not very good at all. Let's have a look at the fan here. Even the fan is slammed full of dust. Let's go have a look at a few more fans like this. Okay, here is my collection of CPU core heat sinkage equipment. And I got all sorts of random coolers. Many are pulled from OEM computers like E-Machines, HPs, that sort of stuff. And of course, many of them have had a lot of use on them. When I part out stuff like this, I like to keep the components for recycling into other computers. Here's another fine example of lack of cleaning. This one here, believe it or not, was much worse. I've actually scraped a good bit of it out with a paintbrush. It used to be a lot worse than that. Let's see what else I have here. Heat sinks like this one here, like this thermal tank, can clog up extremely easy. Notice how close together those fans are. Coolers like this are very crucial when it comes to keeping them clean. There are many types of heat pipe coolers nowadays that have fences close together and all it takes is a month or so for it to get clogged up if you leave your computer on all the time and your CPU will, the temp will climb. Here's this old basic Intel core cooler. These here aren't as bad as, clog, as others in terms of clogging up with dust but after a good bit of time these will clog up too. This one here is kind of clogged up in some areas. When these things clog up, they can't get air through them, so it's crucial to keep them clean. Another heat sink. This one here, I think I've already cleaned out because there's a lot of dust in the fan. I've probably already been out with the paintbrush, but let me have a look in there. You can actually see some dust still clogged up in parts of the fins on the heat sink. Fine example right here clog slam up this here is from I believe an old Intel Pentium 3 Celeron system probably an old HP or something I'm not sure this heat sink here is starting to get a little dirty starting to clog up anyway more or less got a general idea of the importance of keeping your heat sinks clean in your computer well, of course everything in your computer needs to be cleaned once in a while Anyways, any questions or comments, feel free to ask.